COVID-19 vaccinations are underway right now as frontline workers continue to work during this pandemic. One group of workers includes hospital cleaning staff. This morning, 41 Action News reporter Bryant Madrick spoke with one hospital cleaner. Bryant, how does he feel about getting a vaccine working where he works? Well, the hospital worker I talked to tells me that he would definitely be excited about getting a vaccine. Now, I talked to him after contacting his union, the Service Employees International Union. That organization is advocating that other hospital cleaners like him also get vaccinated. Now, he works here at St. Luke's Hospital of Kansas City, right near the Country Club Plaza. He tells me that while he is hoping that he could be in that first group of people to get vaccinated, he still thinks about the virus every single day that continues to sicken people and kill. Does it make you a little scared to do your job? In a way, but I don't let it get to me because uh, I'm kind of used to that kind of a uh, environment when we when you're at the stadium. Uh, there's a lot of things that we have to um, rush through when we get really busy. It's kind of like that, like going through adrenaline. Now, Rodriguez, he tells me that he actually works several jobs in addition to working here at the hospital. And he tells me that it's focus on his job that actually helps him actually get through his duties. Back to you. So safety, one concern. Are there any others? Yeah, pay is the other. Now, he tells me, along with his union, that they actually want employees who work in these hospitals to actually get a minimum wage of $15 an hour. I will tell you that St. Luke's Hospital here in Kansas City, one of the hospitals that actually has put in a minimum $15 wage for the workers, they did that back in November. Reporting live in Kansas City, Missouri, I'm Brian Madrick, 41 Action News.